Hey, what's going on YouTube? Back at you today with a mail day of some cards that I purchased. And we're going to be going over. I got these basically for free. Um, due to credit I had sort of on Macari, which is a, like an eBay-like app. Um, the only bad thing about that app is that it is, the prices tend to be a little bit better when you buy singles of anything. But the important thing is when you buy lots of stuff, because it's mainly for like clutter clearing or anything, um, like a yard sale type um, selling, that you can get lots fairly cheap. So you can get cards basically for free with ones that are good, which was the case here. Now, the place I got this from is called Big Hit Sports Collectibles from Florida. Um, Shout out to you guys. I paid $12 for all of this, which I thought was a steal. For mainly for one card, because one card was worth that. Um, so there's the bubble wrap. Lucky pen knife here. Um, I might need this to cut the tape. I'll set that back. Looks like these guys have did this once or twice. piece and the second piece you can see it's on the front there nice Dave Parker card I believe that's like 75 I forget what year third piece and they all have little pieces on top that I'll keep and Save that you probably just saw it. Those are the three main ones, right? Um, I like two. These guys really put a lot of effort into this. I appreciate that. So if you ever hear a big hit sports collectibles, uh, don't be afraid to buy something from them because they're gonna treat you right here. Um, so let's get in here and look at what they packed. Now, don't, I only really paid attention to the three, the main three, so these are all bonus to me. Nice Fleer Pirate sticker. Joe Lind, rated rookie from 88 Donners. Bill Madlock. And that is from... What year is that? 80. And John Candelaria. I believe he has a relative place for the Tigers now. Real nice card right there. Who's that? Kurt Gibson. Didn't know he was a bucko. Omar Moreno. Oh, Vanilla. Diamond King right there. Classic. Blair. Burt Bylevin. There's an old, old guy that's very underrated. Dale Barrea. Barrea. Ed Ott. Pittsburgh Pirates team card. That is from. That uh, doesn't say what year. I'll have to look that up. Moises Alou. Prospects card. Tony Pena. Bob Clemente. Roberto Clemente. That's a Kmart card. Manny Sanguian. He has his own little restaurant out there at PNC. Rich Hebner. Now all of them. Super veterans. Alright, so some nice bonuses right there, but mainly the reason I bought this was because the last card I'll show you here, I think was worth the actual $12 I paid, and then I got two, one Hall of Famer and one very notable player with him, so the notable player was this Dave Parker, in very good condition. <clears throat> A little off center, but that's okay. From 75, 76 tops, 75 tops. Dave Parker, right there. The next card is the Willie Stargell. Willie Stargell, right there, from the same 75 year. Nice design there, fairly yeah, off centered a little bit, that's okay. Anytime you can pick up a Willie Stargell card, I think it's worth it. And the main event here. 
<clears throat> this is his rookie card in pristine condition. No, I wouldn't say pristine. You can see there's some things down there. I think I'm just hyping this card up a little bit too much. But there you go, Barry Bonds card, which I think that rookie card right there is worth twelve bucks, ten bucks in itself. So yeah. So well, thanks guys for watching. I recommend buying from Big Hit Sports Collectibles. Um, so recap here: these are the three big ones I got: the Star Build, the Barry Bonds rookie, and Dave Parker. Thank you guys for watching, and tune into my MLB videos.